There is divine purpose within you, but purpose building forth within the quality and the quality of divine, immaculate conception and perception. To build forth very righteousness and pride of Jesus, and because of righteousness to then therefore edify strength, build glory, build up purification, sanctification, and actually take the steps that are necessary to be the that will build forth the kingdom of heaven. It is our own joy, our peace that we end up receiving, and it is because of that prayer, sanctification, and thanksgiving that we receive the peace of God that is beyond comprehension. That blessing is actually given forth to all nations. I want you to call on you and to receive it. We talked about actually the way that God is speaking to his prophets. Moisha of honor, David, well, we can run through all of them. Isaiah has a number of showing how what we end up seeing is a mighty prince. Interesting. Mighty prince who loved God. Actually, that's even the connection with an Israel. Israel itself is part of the same manifestation of creation that we end up seeing within Isaiah. And what you find is that it is a mighty prince who knew God. He made straight his path. You see, Isaiah was born with an inheritance of riches and wealth, and he decided to give his life into the gospel. At the time, he was building for his father, the Lord of Israel. And as it turns, it ended up being the very same way as Christ. He built this. And God opens up. It is because of that that we end up receiving the eternal blessing of Christ. Look towards him and receive all of those blessings. Why it is the very grace that we end up receiving because of that. It is the love of the ability to receive.